We're in Segovia, about an hour northwest of Madrid, and one of the most famous things we have is the UNESCO Her Heritage Site, the famous Roman Segovia Aqueducts. It's over 165 arches made by 24,000 stones. And the most incredible thing is there's absolutely no mortar. Segovia is a historic city northwest of Madrid in central Spain's Castile and Leon region. Its centuries of settlement have resulted in a rich architectural legacy, including medieval walls, Romanesque churches, and a former royal palace and Gothic cathedral. Its iconic ancient Roman aqueduct has more than 160 arches. After the fall of the Roman Empire, the region was settled by people from northern Europe, which was then invaded by the Arabs. Segovia has since been the capital of various Moorish kingdoms. In 1088, the city was conquered by Alfonso VI, King of Leon and Castile. Segovia became a royal residence in the seat of the bishop and a prosperous trading center. It is here where the flourishing period of the most Romanesque monuments originated. From the bus station at the bottom of the hill, walking all the way through the historic center of the promenade, lined with bars and cafes. Here you'll notice the first Romantic churches from the 11th and 12th centuries. After these, you'll encounter the imposing aqueduct. From there, you can continue walking through a string of streets, which will open to the Plaza Mayor. In Segovia, one of their most famous dishes is roast suckling pig. So we're here at Restaurante Jose Maria to have just that. And what wine goes with that? But for day home. This eating place offers not only a renowned traditional cuisine, but also excellent wines from its cellar. Nice also to be here just to drink a glass of wine, along with a tapa among the dried hams at the bar. Today, we are here to celebrate friendship and the start of what is going to be an amazing trip. But here's the star of the show. Behold the gastronomic miracle known as Cochinillo of Segovia. I love suckling pigs in a multitude of culinary traditions, which all seem to have a contrast between that melt-in-your-mouth tenderness versus the flesh and the crispiness of the skin. Here in Segovia, the pig is so tender, they cut it with a dull plate. This is tradition has been done for hundreds of years. And boy, was it delicious. After lunch, we stopped at this quaint little wine shop. And one of the really cool things here is it had wine from each of the 15 regions in Spain. We were able to try wines from the Canary Islands and other places that I hadn't been to before. This was really, really neat. In fact, the only disappointment for the entire day was not being able to spend more time at this Iberico ham store. Well, we're back on the road again. This time to Ribera del Duero and Territorio Luthier and Bodegas Aster. Until next time, this is Kevin McGuire saying salute.